Hey, what's going on everybody? We are the Fife Nation, and welcome to episode 36 of my Pokemon Fire Let's Play. Alright guys, in the last episode, well, we really didn't do much. Well, we did make it to Cinnabar Island, and Gilliam did finally evolve into Blastoise, so yeah, I guess we did kind of a lot. I was asked you guys if I should be using Hitmonlee for my team, and you guys said sure. So, so I also asked you what to name Hitmonlee. And well, a lot of you said Bruce, where I totally know where you're coming from, Bruce Lee, Hitmonlee. That's actually where the name from Hitmonlee came from, it's... It, the name for Hitmonlee, Hit-mon-lee. Hit, hits like Lee. Hits like Bruce Lee. Okay, so guys, well you know what, I guess, just for your guys' sake, because this was a really, really popular name. Also named Jet, somebody suggested Jet. I always, I thought that was kind of funny, because that's not actually where the name comes from, but uh... Jet Lee still kind of makes sense. Alright, we're going to be naming Hitmonlee Bruce. And I will catch catch up with you guys back at Cinnabar Island. Alright guys, when I said Cinnabar Island, I actually meant Pewter City because there is something that we have to pick up here. Now, you could have gotten to Pewter City and done this. Uh, you also need a Pokemon that knows Cut for this. You could have gone to Pewter City when uh, you actually went through Diglett's Cave with Cut. But you know what, this is just a lot easier when you have Fly. And you're going to want to go up to the museum to the right here and cut down this tree. And once you have that cut down, you're going to want to come in and enter in here. Now there's an item that we can receive here. Called... Shh, listen. I need to share a secret with somebody. I think this chunk of amber contains Pokemon DNA. Star Wars... Er, wow, Star Wars. Jurassic Park, Jesus. It would be a shattering scientific breakthrough if Pokemon could be resurrected from it. But my colleagues just ignore what I have to say. So I have a favor to ask. I want you to get this examined at a Pokemon Lab somewhere. Okay, we just so happen to know where Pokemon Lab is. Well, actually you guys don't, but I do. Okay, so now that we have the old Amber, you're actually going to want to head back to Cinnabar Island now. That was totally a reference to uh, Jurassic Park, FYI. So, oh, uh, hey, hey, we don't have a moment fly here. Guys, I'll meet you back up at Cinnabar Island. Alright guys, so for realsies this time, we are here on Cinnabar Island. Now from Cinnabar Island, you after you have the old amber, you can head left here and enter in this building. Now this is the Pokemon lab that that, uh, that researcher was talking about. And there is actually some few things that you can do in here, like talk to this guy, and I believe he's a trade, yes. I actually do have a Raichu, I do not want to trade my Raichu for an Electrode, no I, I don't want to do that, that would be stupid of me. What does this man have to say? I found this most remarkable fossil inside Mount Moon. I think it's a rare piece of- I found one too! Hey, you wouldn't have to be that one guy. That one guy, eh? You wouldn't have to be that one guy. Now the room that we want to go to is I believe at the very end here, yes. Now you want to go up and talk to this guy. Hiya! I am a very- I am important doctor, yes, very much so indeed. I hear, I study rare Pokemon fossils all the time, I study. You, have you a fossil for me? We have two, we have the old amber and we have the dome fossil. Let's go ahead and give him the old amber, because we just obtained that. Ah, yes. Is It is a fossil of Aerodactyl, a Pokemon that is already extinct. My resurrection will soon and don't make that Pokemon alive again. Okay, yes, okay, sure. And he says we're going to have to go for a little walk, and all you have to do is walk out of this building, and then walk back in. Now if we go ahead and we talk to him this time... You late! Where are you? Where are you? Your fossil is back to life. It was Aerodactyl, like I think. Alright, so we now have the fossil Pokemon Aerodactyl. Aerodactyl is actually an extremely good Pokemon, although you do get it at level 5, so at this point in the game you'll have to really start training it. It's impervious to electric attacks, and uh, because of the rock, well actually it's not really impervious, it just takes a lot less damage. And uh, it's actually a really good Pokemon, I highly recommend Aerodactyl. And here we go, we have another, no I don't want to do that, we have another fossil to give this guy. Yes, I understand who you are. Yes, we have the Dome Fossil. It is the Fossil of Kabuto, a Pokemon that's already extinct. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and give him Kabuto. And now we walk outside again. And walk back in. We should have Kabuto from this strange little man. From this very strange little man. You late, where were you? The Fossil back late. Alright, so we got Kabuto. No, I do not. Now, Kabuto is an okay Pokemon. I kind of like it. It's a little bit different. It just so happens to be a rock and water type. I know that's kind of weird, isn't it? Uh, basically, most fossil Pokemon that you get are rock type Pokemon. It's got a pretty high defense, and its uh, ability uh, blocks critical hits, so you don't have to be too worried about it. But again, it's at level 5, and it's kind of hard to train up. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead, and I'm going to get Raichu and uh, Bruce back out. 
So, uh, I'll see you guys in just another second. Alright, guys, now I guess we are ready to take on the Cinnabar Island gym. Doors locked. Oh, poop. Oh, poop. Oh, poop. Oh, poop. Poop, poop. No, the door's locked. Okay, well, actually, we know where to go. We know where to go. This is Pokemon. Everybody's played Pokemon. To unlock the door, actually, the key just so happens to be inside this burned down Pokemon mansion. Now, you're gonna wanna have some repels for here because you're gonna actually get some really cool Pokemon in here. I believe you can catch Growlithe in here. And later on, uh, you also catch Coughing, and then again later on, uh, Ditto. And Piss. And Pokemon that are higher level than Gillian. This is a problem. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Okay, well, Gillian's just gonna have to get to level 37, I guess. Now, there's actually a lot of items up here, along with statues, which you can uh, actually press, and a secret switch. Press it. Who wouldn't? Who wouldn't press the switch? Okay, now that. Damn it. Okay, stupid eradicates, why are you level 36? The same level as Gillian. Now that opened up a door somewhere, and we have to go and we have to navigate to be able to find the key. Don't run into any wild Pokemon, please. Please. And there's actually some journal entries in this place, which you learn about a rare Pokemon called Mew. Diary, July 5th, Guana, South America. A new Pokemon was discovered deep in the jungle. Okay. And over here we can... Damn you. Okay. Calcium, okay. Now I'm gonna put a repel back up. And we don't have too many left. That's kind of scary. That scares me. That scares me quite a bit. We don't have too many repels left. Uh, nothing over here. And nothing down here. So we seem to have this area pretty cleared out. Uh, what's over here? Okay, well, you can get an item over on this balcony. Okay, I don't like these radicates at all. I don't like these radicates at all. And here is a zinc. You can actually find the actually uh, most of these uh, items here. They're all vitamins. Oh my gosh, really? Really? We only have two left? Gosh, okay. Uh, what's right here? What was this journal entry? July 10th, we christened the newly discovered Pokemon, Mew. Okay, so that was the discovery of the Pokemon. Are you kidding me? Okay, literally, these have all just been Raticates. I'm not even kidding you. All Raticates. And here we have a trainer, but we really don't have to battle him. So let's head up another floor here. And here there's another journal entry along with the trainer. February 6th, Mew gave birth. We named the newborn Mewtwo. Okay, what's this item? Max Potion. Okay, that'll come in handy in the future. Uh, otherwise, nothing really up here. Wait, what are you? What are you? What are you? You weren't a trainer. Piss. Okay, that guy had a nine tails, and Blastoise defeated him rather easily, and grew to level 37. So no more red kids for me! Yay! No more red kids for me! Yeah! No more red kids for me! Yeah! No more red. Damn it! No more red kids for me! Yeah! Alright, the last three, pal. How far can we get? How far can we get? Actually, we can get 100 steps, but there's an escape rope right there, which will become rather, rather useful to me in the future. Considering I'm gonna have to go back, and I'm gonna get, get more about I wanted to run out, no! Oh, no! Protein! Ah, well, close up me! I don't wanna run out! Don't ah. Okay, guys, I'll be right back. Okay, so I actually invested in the good repels this time. We now have max repels, repelling Pokemon for 250 steps. Those sold for 700. Kind of worth it, in my opinion. Now, we also have another Mew statue right here. And if we click on it, a secret stitch, press it. Who wouldn't? I sure wouldn't, so I don't want to press it quite yet. Now, there's actually a pattern to which you... See, we closed that one gate there, but if we look down here... I don't believe there's one over here. Damn. Piss. Hell. Boom. No, where is this? Where is this? Which one did we close and which one open? Down here, here, down, here, right here. Piss. Hang on. We need to figure out where to go for this place. I always hate these dungeons because it's always like, no! It's always like, oh, where do we go? Oh, I don't know. And then it's like, figure out which ones to press. And now. The ones that we have to press are actually all on different floors, that's I remember clearly. So let's go ahead and press this one again. Secret to press, we wouldn't. Yeah, okay. Now let's go down and go and check this out again. And if we look here, this one opened back up, and this one opened up. Oh, well, this is actually already open, but... Piss! I wasn't right- Piss! Hell! No, what? Hang on. Um... 
Is there an item in here? Is he, okay, come on. Actually, I'm actually fairly certain that there's an item in, like, up here. On one of these. One of these pillars has an item. I wanna say... I wanna say one of these pillars has an item. I wanna say... I wanna say... Never mind. I wanna say never mind. Um... You know what? Hang on, guys. I'm gonna look... Just look where to... How to open that one. Jesus Christ. I hate this. Okay, so many repels later, I figured out what to do. Okay, so we go up here and we just hit this statue. I can't believe I was so oblivious to this. I can't believe I didn't notice that it opened up this one. What? What? No. No. Open up this one. It opened up this one. Thank you. Okay. And now if we go up here, we can find another Mew statue. But if we go to the right here... Nah. See? There was a there was a lot of steps that were taking place. If we go over here and grab this fo one, contains an iron. I almost said fossil for whatever reason. I was thinking fossil Pokemon at the time. And now if we click it, who wouldn't? I sure wouldn't because I'm Jordan. Okay, now we have a battle up here. Okay, sorry about that. I actually had to edit that out. There was some weird glitchy thing that went on and my FPS dropped like a lot. I don't know why I'll have to search for the problem why. Let's head down here first of all and obtain an item known as HP up. Okay, so that's also a vitamin. It just increases your HP. So let's head over here. Also, I tried using Bruce in that fight and he died. So that's kind of sad. Let's head down, down here and see what's down here. Nothing. Not what? Guys, this is a sign. All right, guys. Uh, we are the Fife Nation. I'm gonna be ending the episode off here. I hope this is long enough. I know I had to cut a bunch out. Uh, again, I'm sorry, guys. Uh, we are the Fife Nation. I'll see you all next time. Peace out.